what this place is in nuts and bolts is it's artists working together collaboratively. It's kind of what makes us slightly different. We are the largest art pottery making primarily handmade pieces of art pottery in the country. Kevin started the pottery in 1996, so we have just had 25 years in business. Um, I have a background in art history, so I like to read about these old potteries. And it's 25 years is a pretty long run for an art pottery. Before I started working here, I had no idea the extent, the reach. We have collectors all over the country, all over the world. Art pottery, for the most part, is thrown vessels that are sculpted on. Sometimes they're not sculpted on, they just have really interesting glazes on it. We also make art tile, so decorative art tile that we, uh, we intend for it to be framed and displayed as art. So when it comes time to make these designs that we've brainstormed and codified and, and put into production, we divide out the work. Sometimes Laura may be sculpting frogs and sometimes I may be sculpting frogs that week or sometimes Alec will be throwing certain pots and sometimes Kevin will be throwing certain pots. If you pick up any piece, and that's usually what I'll do is pick up a piece and turn it over, it tells a story. So it'll tell you the year that it was made, it'll tell you who threw it, who sculpted it, who glazed it. And the fact that those are oftentimes three different people is unique. I think there's just so many different reasons why people come to Ephraim Pottery and appreciate Ephraim Pottery. Um, some people it's the aesthetic, some people it's the process, some people it's the philosophy that they're people working together and I like that's kind of my main goal is seeing people that are working together um, creating beauty. As far as I know there is no other studio that I can find that has this collaborative model like we have. We are all making the decisions and the art that goes into giving us a life um, that is a career, a life, um, it's a social network. There's a lot more to it than it just being a product. It's a place where we make just create just beautiful things every day that other people happen to appreciate and we really enjoy doing that and, and seeing the um, joy that it brings to other people as, as much as it brings joy to us. I don't know what the future is going to be, but the people that will come through here and inspire me through working together um, with the other artists here and myself, that's going to be what Ephraim will be five years, ten years down the road, and we just will see where it takes us.